This jar has been sealed for over three years, but there are still things living inside. This is a perfect example of an ecosphere. An ecosphere is an area capable of sustaining life. Here on Jar Planet, we make ecospheres on a small scale by putting them inside of sealed jars. What makes life possible inside of this jar is algae. Algae serves as the primary producer inside this ecosphere. I've noticed four different species of algae. The main inhabitants of this jar are small creatures called ostracods. These small creatures are omnivores, but inside the jar, they live primarily on algae. They can be found in freshwater and marine environments. There are over 70,000 species of ostracods around the world. This ecosphere was made at a local boat dock three years ago. I like this location because it is shallow, slow moving with lots of rocks and algae. The top half inch of sediment looks kind of like jello. It's made of decaying organic material and likely hundreds of dead ostracods. This is a neat example of an ecosphere, but how long will it actually last? There is a balance between ostracod population and algae growth. If too many ostracods are present, the algae will be depleted, causing a famine, and many of the ostracods will die. This process happens again and again until the ecosphere becomes stable. The first month of an ecosphere's life will determine if it will be a success or a failure. Since this ecosphere has survived three years now, it will likely continue living on. I hope this video added value to your day. Don't forget to subscribe and check out our other videos on Jar Planet.